Hello everyone, how to solve this problem for the values of m if we have square root of 5 plus square root of m is equals to square root of 45 and we solve this problem for the values of m. So here uh, first we need to uh, rewrite this equation as we first move the square root of 5 to the right hand side and it will be written as square root of m is equals to square root of 45 minus square root of 5. And here uh, we uh, need to remove this square root sign on both of the sides. So for this we need to do some working in the right hand side. And now here first we make the prime factors of 45 and we know that the prime factors of 45 are 9 times of 5 minus this is our square root of 5. And now further in the next step we have, we know that the square root of 9 is equals to 3 times of square root of 5 minus this is again a square root of 5. And now also you see here. Uh, square root of 5 is lies on both of these terms. So uh, here we take common square root of 5 and we get the remaining values are from here when you take common square root of 5 we get 3 minus from here we get minus 1. And now further in the next step uh, we have square root of this is square root of m and square root of m is equals to square root of 5 into 3 minus 1 is equals to 2. And now here we are ready to uh, remove the square root sign on both of the sides. For this we take, uh, we need to taking a uh, squaring on both of the sides. So when we take squaring on both of the sides it will be written as in this form. And now you see here this 2 and this square root are gone and we will get here m is equals to here we first apply this square separately on both of these values and it will be written as the 2 square into square root of 5 and its whole square. And now you see here we have m is equals to this 2 square equals to 4 and this 2 and this square root are gone and we will get here 5. So further in the next step we have m is equals to 4 times of 5 is equals to 20. So this is the, our final answer of this question and now here in the next step we uh, need to verify this value of m because our given uh, question uh, is a radical equation so that's why uh, we check that is this is the solution or this is the extraneous root of the given equation. So for verification we need to copy down given question statement here it is square root of m plus uh, square root of 5 plus square root of m is equals to square root of 45 and here we substitute the value of m and the value of m is equals to 20 when we put this value here it will be written as square root of 5 plus this is square root of 20 and we check that is this equals to square root of 45 or not and now you see here we have uh, we need to do some simplification on both of the sides and now we write our left hand side as this is square root of 5 and we break this 20 as 5 times of 4. In the same pattern we break this 45 as 9 times of 5. And now you see here we have this is square root of 5 plus here we know that uh, the square root of 4 is equals to 2 times of square root of 5 is equals to this is uh, here we know that a square root of 9 is equals to 3 times of square root of 5. And now you see here square root of 5 be the common term from here we will take common square root of 5 and we get 1 plus 2 is equals to 3 times of square root of 5. And now you see here finally we have 1 plus 2 becomes 3 times of square root of 5 is equals to 3 times of square root of 5. So uh, this shows that the value of m is equals to 20 is satisfied over this given question statement. So finally we say that m is equals to 20 be the only one solution of the given equation.
so this is the our final answer and thank you so much for watching this video please subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos